two Eastern Cape matriculants from opposite ends of the schooling spectrum to the province proud at the National Awards this week. Salbonian Rohin Jain received a first place award for mathematics and physical science in the country and was crowned the top achiever in quintile 5. Uh, technically I was the number one in Salbon from grade 8 onwards. Oh, okay, uh, good, great. Okay. But what would you say set you apart from them? Well, it was very little that set me apart because, you know, there was like a small gap between us. Mm -hmm. But um, I think we're just different characters and I think in these circumstances I just uh, did a little bit better than they did. And how does it feel for people to recognize the kind of achievements you've obviously you spent like um, your entire high school career mm. trying to achieve better every year, I'm assuming, push yourself yeah. more. How does it feel for people to acknowledge your efforts and to see? Oh, it feels really good, you know. It's like part of the reason you're doing it because mm. you, you want the recognition and you know, like you you actually, the most important thing of doing it is that you want to do it for yourself. But it's nice, you know, to get rewarded along the way for these things. The top achiever in quintile 3, Luvo Luzipo, scooped second place in maths and physics in the country. The St. James High School pupil from Tofimvaba told the dispatch he had not seen his results yet, but knew he had seven distinctions. So, um, how did your results? Have you seen your results? No, I have not. Okay. Okay, so you don't know what you got for what, or have you gotten a glimpse of? Uh, a student from my school, so, so uh, I, asked the student, I asked the student from my school to look at my results on the newspaper. Mm -hmm. She told me that I got all seven distinctions, but I do not know what past okay. distinctions. I understand that you were the runner up for the Mets um, Award nationally, is all on it? Was it yesterday? Yes, yesterday I was, I was runner up for Mets and Physics. Okay. So uh, they say it's second best for Mets and Physics in South Africa. Okay, okay. And how does that make you feel? <laughs> I am delighted. I'm, I'm very happy because I put a lot of hard work in, in, in those subjects. Mm -hmm. uh, with my physics and math teachers also going the extra mile in helping us, uh, helping us perform at our best. The two Brainiacs have been accepted for actuarial science degrees at the University of Cape Town. This is Google Pandya reporting for Dispatch Live.